In this video, I'll show you how to set up a BOGO deal in your WooCommerce store in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Okay, so here we are on our demo site and I've created a BOGO offer, right? For customers purchasing um, products within our supplements category. So currently we're in our supplements category. And if a customer purchase um, any two items, they'll get the second item for free, right? The cheapest item for free. So let's go ahead and test this out. So let's add this one to cart. And let's also add um, this one to cart as well. Okay, and I've created this rule to be triggered um, whenever a customer enters in a special coupon code. Um, so again, this is optional. You can just have it um, trigger automatically, but I've set it to trigger with a coupon code. So throughout this video, I'll show you how to have it triggered with a coupon code or without a coupon code, okay? It just so happens that I've got it enabled with a coupon code. So let's enter in our coupon code here and let's click apply. And then our buy one, get one free offer should trigger. Okay, and as you can see, our coupon codes applied successfully. And now we're getting both items for 197, right? So we're essentially getting the second item for free, which is the cheapest item. So if you want to create a similar setup on your WeCommerce store, the first step is to head over to aovup.com. Go ahead and download the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin by AOVUP. I'll leave the link in the description below. And with that being said, let's head over to our dashboard. Okay, so assuming you've downloaded the AOV up dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin, the next step is to go ahead and upload that plugin. So we'll go plugins, add new, go ahead and upload and install the plugin. Once you've done so, you'll see this Wii Suite menu here. If not, you'll see the AOV up um, branding. We've just recently rebranded. Okay, so with that being said, just click activate, enter in your license key. Once you've done so, it will automatically redirect you to this add on section. Okay. Okay, and then from here, we can just go ahead and toggle the dynamic price and then discount rules plugin to on. I've already got mine set to on, so we'll go ahead and click manage. Okay, so a few things to note is we can create our BOGO deal on a global level and that will be based on the category that a customer purchased um, the product in or we can do it on a product by product basis, okay? And that's done on a product level. So we'll just navigate to advanced rules here, okay? And then we'll just click add category pricing and then we can give this a name, it's just for internal purposes. So the quantities will be based on the cart line item. Okay, and then the categories that a customer needs to purchase the product in is our supplement category. So if they purchase any product within our supplement category, then we'll give them a discount. So where it says categories to adjust, this is where the discount will apply to, okay? And um, so we're gonna apply the discount within the same category, okay? Because for this example, so our offer is if they purchase any product from our supplements category, they can have another one for free, okay? So that's our rule, or you could do it like to buy one hat to get an accessory free um, so in that case you'll just select um, accessories as a categories to apply the discount to okay hopefully that's not too confusing so where it says applies to we're gonna we're gonna allow all customers to take advantage of this rule okay so if we wanted we could segment the offer based on um, guest users which are users logged out of our site or user with a specific user role or a specific user okay so we'll just leave it to everyone we can enable this option this first time by option meaning only newcomers will be able to take advantage of the offer okay so we'll leave this disable and for the rule processing mode we'll go ahead and select a special offer okay so first we're gonna trigger it automatically and and then we'll go ahead and trigger it with a coupon, okay? We'll leave it set to without a coupon for now. And then later on, I'll show you how to trigger it via a coupon code. Okay, so um, dates, so we can schedule this campaign to run um, within a given time period. We're gonna ignore this for now. So where it says purchase, so the customer needs to purchase one item, okay, from our supplements category, and then they'll receive the second item for free. So where it says discount type, we're gonna select a percentage discount here, and then we're gonna set the amount to 100%, okay? Meaning the second item that they purchase, they'll get it for free, okay? That's our buy one, get one free offer. And where it says, where it says repeating, we're gonna keep this set to no, because we don't want a customer to purchase four items and they're getting two for free, okay? So we only want the rule to apply once. Okay, so let's hit save changes and then let's navigate to our supplement category. So let's go um, products and then categories. 
Okay, so I've got two products within our supplement category. So I'm going to add um, both products to cart and we should get the cheapest item for free. Okay, so let's go ahead and add this to our basket. Okay, let's go ahead and add this one also. Okay, and if you can see here, the total is still £170, pounds, okay, because we're getting this second item for free. Okay, so our rule's working fine. Now I'll just quickly show you how you can trigger this rule um, based on a coupon. Okay, so let's navigate to our dashboard and let's go ahead and create a new coupon. So marketing and then coupons. I'm going to go ahead and add a new coupon code here. So where it says discount um, type and a discount amount, we can just leave this blank, okay? And you'll see why in a second. We just need to remember the coupon code. Okay, so now when we navigate back over to advanced um, rules, and then if we edit this rule that we've created, so let's first refresh this page, okay? And then where it says apply here, we're gonna select with a coupon, okay? And then within this box, we can go ahead and select um, from any of the coupons that we've got on our site, okay? So I'm gonna select this Boggle coupon, which we've just created, and then I'm gonna go ahead and hit save changes. Okay, so let's go ahead and test this again. So we'll refresh the page. Hopefully there's no caching. Okay, so here you can see the price is 244, right? So let's go ahead and add our coupon code, which is BOGO, and we'll click apply coupon. Okay, so our coupons applied successfully. And here you can see it's triggering the promotion, which we created in the back end, right? And now we actually get in both items for 197, which is how it should be. And that's a quick and simple way to set up a BOGO deal in your WooCommerce store. As usual, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you got any questions, leave it in a comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.